Hey guys, welcome back to Planet Zoo Console Edition, and I just quickly wanted to show everybody uh, what happened here at the end of this rainforest level. They sent me this panda, so I made an enclosure real quick, a little climbing structure for him, and the uh, Lin Lin, <clears throat> she should be doing great. Yes, Lin Lin. The great panda is here in the rainforest, and hopefully we can assign a keeper to her to get her some food. And, uh, yeah, so I, that's all I had to do was house that great panda, and then this level is now complete. So, what we're going to do today is uh, check the next level on the list, and then maybe go into some timed challenge stuff, which is like my least favorite thing in simulation games. Uh, <clears throat> uh, like Avon Colony and uh, Tropico, and I forget, something else may have had like time challenges. I really don't like building under a time limit. I don't like it, especially in a game like this where everything takes a long time to, like, build or process. I don't understand how you're supposed to beat these in, like, an hour. Unless everything's just pre-built and you have to just quickly fix stuff while the game is paused. I don't know if that's how it works. We'll find out later. <clears throat> Greener Pastures, Nevada State Eco Zoo. Nestled within a rocky valley and atop a small mesa, Emma Goodwin's first zoo is also intended to be a world's first. A zoo with as much diversity in its flora and fauna and with peerless environment credentials. Without a doubt, the Nevada State Eco Zoo is a big swing for the fences. And guess who's up at bat? Me. It's me. <clears throat> I am. Also, just a quick, like, heads up, uh, if the stream cuts out, it's because my internet went out, and I've had internet outage issues today, but the wind is dying down. We had, like, a big snowstorm last night, and it knocked out my uh, my power and my internet, so just keep that in the back of your mind if it, if it does go out. <clears throat> it's because of the wind. A long it, it time should be ago, okay. I said you we'll always see. have a place in my company, and that's still true. Unfortunately What's up, for you, that place is in the zoo's outbox because you're fired. It's not all bad though. Wait, I'm As fired. Part of your severance package, what did you I do? To keep your uniform. Don't worry, I'll take the cost out of your final pay packet. Oh, hello there. It's Emma again. I just got fired, I'm so Emma. Happy to hear the news about Dominic firing you. Wait, why were you happy? Oh, sorry. Well, Oh, that came across terribly. <coughs> I simply mean that the timing of your dismissal is extremely serendipitous. Oh, see, God, sorry, that? I had to clear Something out my whole before. exhaust pipe well, here. I'm excited to say it has finally come to fruition. <coughs> Something went down As the wrong result, tube. I found I'm fine. I need of a zoo manager. And while I could do it myself, I This is a really pretty area, fly. though. <laughs> Let me Reminds me of the Green see, Canyon. I plan on constructing a chain of zoos as rivals to those of Mr. Myers. Zoos where both the welfare of the animals and our planet is of paramount importance. The eventual goal? To drive Mr. Myers out of business and rescue the animals he's exploiting. But such a task is not simple. I will need someone like yourself who is qualified to handle the building of the zoos. While I concentrate on the overall. Yeah, this game looks business. actually really good so, on console. All the animals so far difference? are very impressive. <clears throat> do 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 do. All right. Welcome to your new zoo. This should be a much more pleasant experience for you than your recent ones, and it should be more exciting too. So Just we start from a, scratch with nothing. Oh, we get to like actually build our Myers. own thing here not on this level. Won't be challenging. I mean, cool. I want the zoo to become a paragon of eco-friendliness. You might Where's say, the edge? Can I, like, build down in this gorge? Print. 
This would be a cool oh, no, map no. to like bring into Sorry. sandbox outside of career mode and play with. I would actually do that. The rainforest one was a maybe, but this one is like, yeah. This would be a good map, dude. Okay. So, uh, adopt and place four different habitat species. Get two timber wolves. Increase conservation rating to 1.0. Reach 10% plant diversity. I don't know where you see plant diversity. I'm assuming that's just under the animal tab. Like, I don't know. We're at 0%. There's no animal market. How am I supposed to get animals? Are there wild animals? I go wild animals. Let's see if we can find the right path here. Asphalt. So let's just uh, build out this way and then curve this because that can be the edge of a habitat right there. And then we'll curve this way. And I want, since there's so much water here, I want that part of a habitat maybe split that in half or something. For like something that's maybe semi aquatic or just likes to swim. We could put all our staff buildings right here, in this little pocket. <clears throat> or right here, and then have a small exhibit right here. I don't know. Uh... Let's do something like that. Okay, so we got $20,000 to do something. Well, I don't understand how I'm supposed to get animals. What is this? Memorials? Because usually we get stuff from uh, this tab. There's nothing here. And it says to adopt the timber wolves, but they haven't shown up. So maybe they just want me to start building. I don't know. So this is Nevada. Biome, desert. <clears throat> they might accept some grassland here. Let's select uh, North America. Let's just see what the game has to offer for plants. We got cac barrel cactus. We got bluegrass. We got patches of grass, buffalo grass. Reeds that you put down by the water. I don't know how to align these ever, by the way. Like, do I do we want them at an angle? Because I feel like plants grow to the sun and not really at an angle. So you have to, like, put it on flat ground and then drag it over and then bring it down for, like, a proper reed placement. It seems like a lot of work. But there you go. <clears throat> there you go. Micro detailing. It's also these little bushes and plants. The zoo is open. Place animals in habitats to show up here. Uh, well, I don't even have animals. So... I uh, don't know what you want me to do. 
Should have some big trees. I like these Joshua trees. They're very spiky or furry. These prickly pears come from Planet Coaster. I recognize those. I wonder if it's the same cacti. Like these big ones. I wonder if these are the same ones from Planet Coaster. They look similar, but it's impossible to know. It's impossible to know. Uh, the Weeping Willow. I'm just seeing what's available. Is this a different kind? This looks very similar to that type. Is this like working? <sighs> There's nobody here. Adopt and place four different habitat animals. But when you go to the animal tab, there's there's nothing. So I don't... Can I use a blueprint? Or do I have to build a new thing? This is for an exhibit, I think. Maybe let's go to facilities and see. I know they want habitat animals, right? There's a walkthrough exhibit. That's interesting. Not really sure what kind of animals can go in there yet. Uh... Staff room? These have to be far away from where people can actually see them. But I found out that like two squares is pretty is enough for most buildings. Utilities have to be a bit further away. But staff buildings and stuff like that. Only have to be about two squares. There we go. I'm going to start sinking cash because we don't have anything going here. What do I need for... Uh, trade Center, right? That's all I need to get started, I think. Do, 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 do. There we go. All right, let's see. Uh, timber wolves. That's what they listed first. So I think that's what we're... We're not going to worry about the other things since this is like the objective animal. These are pretty cheap. They're like about 300 a piece. I forget the exact number that we can have. So I want to check the Zoopedia. We just had some of these recently. It's 2 to 12. Okay. 12 males or 12 females, but it doesn't give me a ratio of male to female. As long as they're in a group of 2 to 12, it might not matter. This is the type of stuff I have to learn in this game. Is like group numbers and breeding stats and all this stuff, and if you want to gain conservation points in career mode, the best thing to do 
is to release animals into the wild, but they can't be pregnant, they can't be juvenile, and they can't be sick. Though that's the rule for releasing an animal to the wild. But if it's like a healthy adult, you can send it out and I think the more prestigious the animal, the higher the points. Like an a frog won't get you more than maybe thirty points, but a, a wolf like this maybe two hundred <clears throat> conservation points. So, I mean, I've seen giraffes and tigers go for about 900, so, yeah, based on one adult, how do we, how do we base this on 12 adults? How many, 2,000 square meters, 2,000 square meters and we're gonna have it be right here right at the beginning Timberwolves can jump but I don't know if they can climb they might need something better than wood logs but we'll just place this down if I need to replace it with a different border we can do that later go to the edge here do that. 2,000 square meters. Now I know 2,000 is pretty big. So I want to stop like about there. There's a couple different ways to build habitats in this game. Um, and I'm still kind of getting used to it. But you don't have to place a barrier like this. You can just build like construction stuff or rocks or whatever and then do null barrier around the whole thing. But I'm pretty sure that timber wolves are crafty. Cause we had one a long time ago that escaped, so I'm going to just use the base barriers here. And then highlight that. Give us a window. Highlight this corner. Give us some glass there. So when you walk in directly, it'll be the first thing you see. And then down here, around the corner, you can see them from there. And then the shelter could be maybe in the back, like a little cave. We could build a cave for them. Uh, the only way to know how large this is, is by placing a gate. So let's place a gate, and then we click on this, and it'll tell me the exact space. This is not enough space for 12 wolves. But it's enough space for a couple wolves. We don't have to get 12 right now. But this should be okay. For what we're doing. And then we go to the animal market. And we'll pick out uh, one, two, three, four. Four to start with. Why is there a buffalo? <laughs> it was like, do you also want a buffalo in there? I don't think that's how this works, game. All right. I don't want them to get sick. So a vet surgery sounds really important. I know this is an expensive building, but I can't risk my animals getting sick. Like, right off the bat. That would be really bad. So I feel like that's a, a worthwhile expense. Get the animal. 
quick. We already spent like half my money. We're sinking. I always forget where the donation bucket is. Right here, donation box. Wait, the wolf. Hey, the wolf. We gotta pause the game just for a minute, buddy. Hi. Okay, so London here is a male timber wolf and we're going to wait for the others to know how much shelter we need, but for the terrain, we can base it off of him. So he does not like all this sand. He wants some short grass and snow. So we might have to put a cooler. We might have to put a cooler in here. Which is under habitat. Cooler. Right. Okay, that's going to melt immediately. He doesn't like the prickly pears. He wants Asia, Europe, North America, tiger, taiga, temperate, or tundra. So let's do North America, since that's where we are. I don't think you can climb. Can you climb? Can wolves climb? Like IRL or in game? Does anybody know? I'm just gonna place a few of these things down and see which ones it likes and which ones it doesn't. It's too big. This does not look like it comes from North America. This is a coconut palm. I guess Florida or California might have those. Let's get more of a tropical vibe to it though. I don't want coconut palms in here. Yeah, I don't think he liked those. Golden rod, I'm allergic to that. London Pond, weren't London Plain, weren't you named London? Isn't that his name? I think his name is London. He didn't like the cactus. He might like these small maples. The creepers. Do they have, like, piles of leaves? I know they have some stuff for, like, the ground. Just single branches. That's kind of crazy. Uh, yeah, these are, like, wall crawlers. Uh, sage bush. I mean, it would be under here. I don't really see what I'm looking for. I guess... Hmm. That might count. Are
Okay, we don't want to be blocking the gate. Actually, so. Do what do you like and what do you not like? Tell me now. He doesn't like that. He doesn't like that. Everything else he says fine. Okay. I feel like he can jump, but I don't know if he can climb. But we're not even going to take the risk. We're going to turn climbing off of these big tall ones. Enrichment. I'm assuming I don't have anything by default. Let's put the food by the window so people can see you eating. They might want to watch that. I think it sounds violent to me. Yeah, there's no... We're going to have to unlock all that. We'll wait till all four are in before we build a shelter. Hey, da doggo. Hey, da doggo. Hi. Puppy. It's a puppy. People are coming in. How much are tickets? Five bucks a piece? It's scorching out here, says one entrant. One one person total. So we don't have a lot of money, so we want to be careful what we're spending money on. But the animal welfare right now is the uh, the most important thing. These are twenty dollars a piece. My goodness. How should we display this drink place? Mm. Right on the corner. That.
couple of benches so people can just sit and chill. Trash bins. So we don't make a mess. And then before we go completely bankrupt, one little video thing here. I also want to figure out how those game cameras work. I'm really interested to see if you can like link a, there's like a, a watch camera. I want to know if you can link that to like one of these projectors outside. There's got to be a way to do that, because I know there's like a million camera options that I haven't even gone into. This game's got so much going on. <laughs> Alright. I would like to build... a proper... have a proper shelter made out of rocks that hopefully they can't jump up. And I don't know. Can you make rocks non-climbable? Yeah, I don't think that's a thing. It should tag if animals can climb. Like, yeah, okay. Because they can definitely jump. But if I put a couple of these, like, around the back, I okay, we can make our own little cave here. And that would be super cool. Go like this. Go like that. Go like that. I don't want all the rocks to be like exactly the same. Uh, orientation. I want some a little bit leaning or wobbling just to make it look more natural. Do 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 Alright. Oh, 
I had it the way I wanted it. There we go. Rock placement simulator. If you play any of these planet games, you know. This this is where you spend the majority of your time. <laughs> this is it. This is the game. And I wouldn't have it any other way. I don't like that you can see it outside the barrier. I don't know how else to do it. probably hide it from the outside with more rocks but I don't want to waste too much money oh. all right so that's close at 79 is good enough I'll give them some sleepy beds go sleep in there. That's just a really, really, like, took two seconds to build basic cave. And now you can, you could spend a million hours doing that in sandbox, but we're not in sandbox. So I don't want to do that. The zoo is low on cash. I feel like this is too far away from where people are actually. I'm just gonna move this for now. Doesn't cost anything to move it. Dollars. There's one habitat. The plant diversity, does that mean from different... Do they mean from, like, different continents? I know what that means. Asia taiga. Is that a thing? That's a good thing, right? That means they're happy. Not really sure what it means. They're saying something. They got something to say, and they're saying it. Why does this look like it's sideways? It's a weird looking bush. Hmm. 
Copy this. Place that about here. Okay, where's my power reach out to? About there, so yeah. This is just within the range. Because your entrance counts as your first basic power utility. So you don't actually have to build a generator right at the beginning. So that saves you money, I guess. That's them being generous to new players like me. Tickets are overpriced. Well... You know, I need to make money. This zoo is pretty small. I- it just opened! Shut up! Literally opened with like four wolves, and you were like, "This is not enough." <laughs> what are you doing? Are you peeing in the bushes? That went up to 4%. Yeah, they just want a lot of this crap. That's what they want. They just want a lot of this crap. But I feel like these little... Plants don't do much for it, so we might just have to place a bunch of big trees down later. Look at them all. They're so cute. They're sleeping in a group. I got wolf pack. I got wolf pack in here. I'm, uh, we might have to take a uh We might have to take a loan. And I'd hate to do that right at the beginning, but... I don't really want to fail this quickly. Take a loan and save Nevada State Eco Zoo. So this one's all about like having multiple plants and a unified something or other. <laughs> unified environment where everything's together.
And we charge 15 cents for the bathroom. And we... I wish I would synchronize by, like, default. I feel like, who does not synchronize prices across their maps? Who's not doing that? Yeah, why is that just not an automatic thing? Ow. Need a keeper hut. Keeper hut is the green apple. Research has been disabled for the vet. Is it because we don't have a workshop? I thought the workshop was for just the mechanics, like upgrades. I hope we don't need a quarantine man. Can we just do a research center? Okay, start with the timber wolf. It says to do this across habitats. So, plants outside of the habitat wouldn't matter. These are all the same plant! They're all the same tree! Where'd you come from? Why'd you get reboxed? They do that every now and then, and I don't know why. I didn't do anything wrong. Why'd we rebox them for? Nothing's been changed. Maybe it was just a vet check, I don't know. Six percent. Oh my god. Uh, every plant I place is like another one percent. Hey, he's pooping in front of all the guests. Nice. Sure, they appreciate that. What was the other one? Tundra of Europe. Specifically. The Tundra of Europe. Uh, well. These are pretty big. They should count. Now, diversity means having multiple ones, of, or having different ones, so I don't know if that'll help. That's 7% now. 
Okay. We just need to reach 10%. That's 7%. There's a lot of big trees in there. <laughs> That's what the game wants me to do. And it says habitat animals, which does not include exhibit animals, but it's really easy to make money off of breeding exhibit animals. So, with that being said, let's do a small exhibit. We got rattlesnakes, titan beetles, puff adders, tarantulas. Uh, I think puff adders are the desert snake, right? So this would be the right habitat for those. But I don't want to spend points for a male. You know what? Let's do the diamond back. How do I cancel an order? I changed my mind. I don't want this one. I want to do the diamond back. I go male and female. Animal trade. Took a second to get the other one. Now! Don't forget to split group. I always screw that up. And I forget to do it. And then I delete the whole thing. Even if it highlights this item alone, you have to split it. Western Diamondback. Exhibit 1. Temperature has to be a little bit cooler than that. And a little bit higher than that. What do you want your temperature at? 85? That's just for money later. That's not really for an objective or anything. That's planting a seed, or I guess hatching an egg. <laughs> hatching a, a snake egg, if you will. We already got our first uh, wolf unlock real quick. This happened really fast. Some of them take a while, and I don't know. I don't know why. It's just the spr oh, because it's the sprinkler. <laughs> Boring. Put the sprinkler next to the coolers. And it'll be like frozen water coming out of there. Do, do, 
Mexalente? There's no Mexalente! Who said Mexalente? Who did that? I heard you. <laughs> Who said that? You've been banned, sir. Okay, so this will all be... Work zone one. Emmett. My name's Emmett, and I work at the zoo. Can you really build four exhibits with $20,000? Cause I, we just had $20,000. I went down to eight. So, I uh, don't believe you. Why is, there, why is that umbrella so small? That's like an umbrella for one person. There's just a log. Look at my statue. Appreciate it. Appreciate my statue. I wish there was somewhere to sit down. I just put a bunch of benches. Unless they mean like a picnic table. In which case, I don't really know if picnic tables work in this game. I'm assuming they do. There's only one bench available. <sighs> Gosh. That research for the diamond back rattler. This will give the snake some hiding place. Uh, Springbok, Crocodile, Red Panda, that's conservation points only, uh, Zebras, Elephants, okay. Flamingos are cheap and easy, we could do Flamingos. That's a good idea, let's do Flamingos because they're really basic.
They don't need much space at all. But I have to leave some space for land. We've had, we've done flamingos before, and I learned that they, uh, they need a little bit of land in the middle of everything else. I kind of want to put it right there, but I feel like you walking this way, immediately seeing the gate is off-putting. But it's kind of funny to me that the gate's right there. the other side put some glass here so people can see flamingo flopping ghosts and then how much area is this this is 944 they need like half that right Yeah, they don't even need half. They couldn't have twice that. This is going to be way too much space. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to put water in it. So that's going to actually remove the amount of land that's there. Wait, there's no water tool? Um... Hold on, what? There's no water tool allowed. But I need to walk. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I need water. I just spent money on that. What do we do? I uh, was assuming there was... If I can do other terrain tool, why is the water off? Uh, just because we're in the desert? I don't even know what the best thing to do now is. Wait for the flamingos and let them go. Scrap the flamingos and get something else. That sucks. I wish I checked that earlier.
One more animal has a condition? No, it doesn't. It doesn't have a condition. I can put it in with the wolves. I've got a freaking flamingo I can't even take care of now. God dang it. Who put this on the list? If it does. These all need water. Fine, as zebras it is. I'm mad now. I just wasted cash I don't have. got grassland zebras here. Grass bed. And what kind of plants do you guys like? Grassland Africa. Baobab, the great Baobab tree. Those are cool, but they take up so much space. Wasted money. Not happy about it. Nobody told me there was no water tool in this career mode. Why would that be a thing? Like, if you can do terrain editing... I like these. These are kind of crazy.
I think this is a water plant, though. Mm -mm -mm. Right, what does that put this at? There's the ten percent. boy <laughs> ongoing expenses animal food imagine having to feed an animal in a zoo. What a concept. Do they like all these plants? Yeah, they don't care. Feeding wolves apparently is expensive. Look, I can have a bowl full of water, but I can't make a ground pool. That would be insane. Stupid flamingo. <laughs> You've cost me my entire life. Yeah, it does it requires water. It requires water. I can't even get rid of it. Guess I'm throwing it in there. I don't know. I don't know what to do about it. Stuck with a bonus flamingo. <laughs> now I know two zebras aren't enough zebras. Dude, I can't even... I have a plan. Wildebeest can live with zebras. How many wildebeests in a group? Seven? Seven? Or something? Why can't I not sell you? Huh? Like, I don't understand. I can't put it up for trade. I'm just stuck with this flamingo. Kind of sucks. The timber wolf is about to mate. Not on my stream, you don't. It's kind of cool that you can see the size difference between the male and female, though.
They're going to have puppies, and then we're going to sell the puppies to the Tiger King. I mean, uh, that's not going to happen, don't worry. Conservation rating. What is that based on? Where do I see that? Conservation. Is that not under education? How do I even know what that's under? Conservation rating? Is that just like the stars? Is that this? How do I get that up? Is that just based on this board thing? Or is that like releasing animals to the wild? We can get a conservation board. I don't know if that's what they mean. I think it means releasing things into the wild. You can't even, like, uh, click on it to see what they mean. Exactly. I see it here. Conservation rating. It just has to do with these? There's got to be something other than these that raises it, though. There has to be something else. It can't just be these boards. There has to be maybe a guest talk. Maybe some, some other item. Exploitation. Like zoos. No, I'm just kidding. Wait, don't blame me. Uh, it wasn't me. I didn't do it. Now, does the cooler affect the exhibit? Because the temperature in the exhibit is internal. Yes? Mm -hmm. There's a snake in a hole down there. There's another one in there. You can't even see it from the <laughs> from the thing. <laughs> it is not to be seen. It is not for the human eyes to witness. We got wildebeests over here. I got zebras. <laughs> but we need more of each. In three exhibits. Well, I guess we're making a path down to the water. I know I can get crocodiles. But I feel like... 
I'm gonna need a flamingo. They don't need deep water. Let's not go too far. There we go. That'll work. Gate. I'm gonna need those flamingos back, aren't I? Flamingos aren't going to bring a lot of guests in. This is so far away from, like, everything. That's part of the problem, too. We're gonna go down there and people are gonna complain or the staff is gonna complain that it's too far from a works uh, or staff room, I guess, for breaks. And there's no power out here either. So hooray for that. Okay. I like that you're floating in the air. Fix the barriers. The wolves are going to break out. I know they just had babies. I know, I know, I know. I'll check that in a second. But wait. Wait. This is not enough area? Usually the flamingos require like no space. <sighs> mm. It's 
almost too much, or almost enough. How'd that not... How'd that not increase? Oh, there it goes. It's because the game was paused. a flamingo needs a shelter. much coverage. Well, I do need a plant in here. I know the these don't like plant covers though, but I need a plant in there. I don't have a choice. I have to. There's so much poop. So much animal crap in there. Where's the puppies? I know there's puppies in here. Hello, are you the only one? Did they only have one? I know sometimes they can have twins. It's probably easier if I just click the gate and look. Tristan is a new boy. He's the brand new boy around here. He's barking. He's walking around in crap. Flamingo issue now. I need another vet. Because there's a disease. We stop this research and go into this research instead. They don't like cohabitants? It says it only wants to be... It's complaining about... 
not having enough. But then it was like, I want to be alone. That's not right. Flamingos are in large groups. They're in ten. They like to be in groups of ten. Which is a lot. That's how many toes I have. I mean, what? For the zebra. Just snapping through the glass, that's good. One for the wildebeest. One for the flamingo. Even though there's no power. Well, let me place a bench down here. Even though it's on the ground. We were making one penny worth of money here. I think I have to snap these onto the path to make them work sometimes. I really don't want to do that. I just don't like the way that looks. But that might be my only option there. Conservation rating. gotta be with letting animals uh, go free in the wild. So we've learned about the American bison and I believe the African buffalo. I don't remember if we read this Zoopedia yet. The black wildebeest is a large uniclate species native to South Africa known as the new after the distinctive noise they make when alarmed. The species is recognized by a brown to black coat with L-shaped horns and 
Males can be distinguished from females due to their darker color and larger size. Both sexes have thick, bushy manes and a long, horse-like tail, measuring between... Does that say 5.6 and 7.2 feet long? Black wildebeest are not currently endangered, but they were almost hunted to extinction in the late 1800s. Yeah, to me, like on the conservation things, like poaching isn't even like on the list. Like when you go to this. Oh, it is. Well, it's included with pet trade. I feel like the, they are somewhat connected, but to me, that's like kind of two different things. Maybe the game disagrees. Maybe some people disagree. I feel like those should.